another video. So today we are going to talk about something very serious. Serious? Oh. Today we are going to talk about student suicide. Oh. Kota, a city that sounds like the general category students hate. Kota has been the coaching hub for all the aspiring engineers and doctors since the 90s. Doctor man hai, go to Kota. Engineer man hai, go to Kota. Suicide karna hai, go to Kota. So every year around 1.5 lakh students mostly from central India go to study at these coaching classes. Because getting into an IIT is a classic middle class Indian dream. Sharma ji ke bete ko dekha hai. So last year there were 31 student suicides in India. That is not the kind of record we want the students to break. IIT, IIT, IIT. So this is what a student is expected to do. First you have to go to school so that you can do well in your CBSE board exams. Then you have to go to 5 to 6 hours coaching classes to do well in IIT, JE. Then you have to go to 2 to 3 hours tuition classes to do well in those coaching classes. Then you have to do your homework to do well in your tuition classes, coaching classes, CBSE board exams. This is not education. It is third degree torture. I'm pretty sure if you do this torture to the criminals, they'll admit to their crime in two days. I did this, I did this. Please stop teaching me kinematics. I would kill people. Please stop. There is a lot of financial stress on students as these coaching classes cost a bomb. And sometimes parents have to take a loan to make this happen. And the biggest stress factor is the fact that 13 lakh students appear for IIT JEE every year. And only 10,000 make it. Only 0.007% make it. That's it. Even if one student is killing himself because of stress, it is still a ridiculous number. So the biggest problem is that coaching classes teach you physics, chemistry, maths, but they never teach you how to deal with rejection. A lot of people can be blamed for these suicides. The education system, the society, the government. But there are specifically two kinds of people I want to address. Number one, parents. Most of the suicide notes written by the students had them apologizing to their parents for not living up to their expectations. Talk to your kids, ask them what they want to become, what they want to study. It is 2017, there is so much that your child can do so much that he can become. He can become a lawyer, a journalist, a chartered accountant, a photographer, filmmaker, DJ, animator, army officer, entrepreneur or a YouTuber. Self-promotion high five. Number two, students. Listen, IITs are great except the fact that sometimes they create Chetan Bhagat or Kejriwal. But engineering or even medicine for that matter of fact is not the end of the world. But if you are hardworking, eventually you will do well. I am saying this because I know exactly how you feel. I went to IIT coaching classes for two years and those were the two worst years of my life. I have been depressed, I have stopped talking to my friends. I have scored minus 25 in my tests and not told my parents. Sorry Papa, sorry Mom. So I am one of those many many people who have gone through this. The point is you will be fine if you do something else. As you grow older you will realize that there are millions of ways to earn money or to earn so called respect in the society. You may think that your parents don't really care about you and they just want you to get a rank but trust me there will be people who will be devastated if you are gone. Okay fine study it's good but enjoy your life man and as Abdul Kalam once said some of the brightest minds of the country will be found on the last bench of the classroom. So this is all for today's video. If you liked it make sure you give it a huge thumbs up. Bye!